Hello everyone, welcome to Excel Engineering Education. In this video, we will discuss about propped cantilever. A propped cantilever is a one having a cantilever at its end a roller support. So there are total four reactions, four unknowns will be there in the propped cantilever. So this is a static indeterminate beam. How to solve this beam? Because we cannot solve this beam using a equilibrium equation because we already know that there are three equilibrium equations summation of f of x is equal to zero, summation of f of y is equal to zero and sum of the moment is equal to zero. But here fourth unknown is there therefore we cannot use our equilibrium equations to solve this beam. Then we have to solve it a different method. Let us consider this beam can be split up, split up in a two way. One is nothing but a simply cantilever and another one will be the deflection due to at its end. Let us consider that which is a simply a cantilever beam whenever it is there due to the loading maybe the UDL maybe the point load this will going to be deflect by some angle that is the delta and again when we remove that load and when we apply a single point load which is at Sim, uh, which is that roller support it will going to be deflect in this way but ultimately this deflection let us consider this is point b so deflection at b both end at the end is zero because we we already know that for the simply supporter at the end the deflection will going to be zero therefore delta b due to continuity equation our delta b is equal to delta b here let us consider delta b is equal to delta b dash using this concept we can solve we can determine the reaction components of a beam let us consider a simple a cantilever beam a propped cantilever a b having a udl w per meter and length is l due to the udl it will going to be deflect so we already know that a cantilever beam having udl delta that is nothing but a depletion is equal to wl cube upon 8 ei and when we apply only a single point load here due to this point load it will going to be deflect in an upward direction that is nothing but delta due to the reaction rb is equal to rb into wl cube upon 8 ei this is nothing but a delta due to the point load acting at its end cantilever beam having a point load at its end therefore these two deltas that is delta b and this delta b dash is equal to is equal therefore delta b is equal to delta b dash that is nothing but w l cube upon 8 ei is equal to rb into l cube upon 8 ei when we solve this we will get answer as rb is equal to 3 fourth of w l when we know this we can calculate ra is equal to total load is w into l minus 3 eighth of w into l therefore ra is equal to 5 eighth of w n to l these are the reaction component of a propped cantilever now we want to calculate a moment at a so moment at a is nothing but rb this is nothing but a point load rb into its length multiplied by load into distance w into l into l by 2 but we already know that rb is equal to 3 8 of w into l therefore ma is equal to 3 8 of w into l into l minus w l square by when we solve it, we will get a value as moment at A is equal to minus WL square of by 8. Using this concept, we can solve different types of propped cantilever as we already know that a propped cantilever is nothing but a combination of a cantilever having a roller support at its end. Using this concept, using the continuity equation concept, we can determine the reaction components for a propped cantilever. Thank you. Thank you for watching. Kindly like, share, subscribe, Excel Engineering Education.